on a late summer's evening, there's nothing quite as entertaining as settling down in a comfy garden chair to watch the bats come out to swish and swoop on their hunt for food. They're fascinating creatures, but they need our help. Here's how you can do your bit. Bats have a prodigious appetite for insects, so one of the simplest ways you can help them is to boost the local insect population. Nectar-rich flowers are a great way to do this. Include a range of flower types, from daisies such as cosmos and oxide daisy, umbellifers like sea holly and yarrow, to flowers with long pollen tubes like thistles or honeysuckle. Include flowering herbs, and because bats are nocturnal, night-scented flowers such as evening primrose and night-scented stock to attract moths. A pond or boggy area offers homes for the aquatic larvae of insects like small flies, a favourite of pipistrelles, while areas of longer grass a fantastic habitat for a whole range of bugs. Other insect habitats include open-sided compost bins and of course bug hotels and log piles. Include trees and shrubs as shelter and food for insects, while climbing plants take all the insect activity skywards where the bats are. Bats will really appreciate somewhere to roost and now's a great time to put up new bat boxes in preparation for next year. You can buy bat boxes or easily make your own. Hang them up as high as you can in a sheltered sunny position that gives a clear line of flight into and out of the box. There's lots you can do to help these tiny mammals. For lots more ideas, do take the time to head to the website, where you'll find ideas for laying on a bat banquet by creating habitat for the bugs they eat, as well as full instructions to make your own bat box.